Buongiorno Napoli. So right now I'm in what they would call one of the most notorious neighborhoods of Naples called Quartieri Spagnoli. Check it out. It's been a really long time since I've last made a vlog. It's my first day in Naples and what I love most about it so far is the fact that no one is wearing face masks. So I'm just gonna keep rolling tape now. Let's see how it goes. What can we find around here? So I've asked a few people now if this is the if this is the area, and they all said to me yes. The whole area on the hill that is all Quartieri Spagnoli. So what do you think so far? Behind me you can see the sea. Well you could see the sea. Now we've passed it. Check out the street. A lot of you are always questioning me and asking me, Kurt, why do you go to the most rundown areas of the cities always? Why don't you ever go to the more beautiful sides and all that? Well, the simple answer to that would be, it's boring and if you want to see it, you can just type it in on Google and you can see it. But the more local places, like here, where I stand a higher chance of getting my camera snatched from my hand, um, is more interesting to see and uh, less of it online. Wow, so in front of me there is a whole bunch of guys. I'm gonna probably put the camera down and film over there. And they're checking me out. Okay, so I just had a, uh, I don't know why I stopped rolling, but I just had a bunch of guys telling me to stop filming. I should have let it carry on, but they were like... So let's probably get the hell out of this area for now. Hopefully no one, hopefully no one rides up behind me and snatches my camera. That's all I'm, uh, that's all I'm worried about. Because I can run really fast in these. Sexy flip-flops, believe it or not. Got quite a good 50-yard uh, dash. As uh, Jorge Masvidal would say. Oh. There's just a... Uh, Dudes on scooters, left, right and center. So you really have to keep your eyes peeled in this place. Well, that's the first time I've had that. A bunch of dudes telling me to stop filming. Ah, oh, man, I wish I would have got that on camera. I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate from this video. Saying, no, but Kurt, this place is, there's nothing wrong with this place. This place is perfectly fine. Yes, well, you never walked around with a, a camera on a selfie stick. That's why it's perfectly fine. That's the big difference. I'm holding a camera and I'm talking to it at the same time. So people think I am molto crazy. What do you guys think about going up here? Looks pretty sketchy to me. Let's go. Is this area dangerous with the camera? Camera? Yeah, it's dangerous with the camera? Si, si. Dangerous? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Picoloso? Si. Wow, okay. Uh, stealing? Or? Si, si. Yeah? Pericoloso. Okay. Okay, gracias. Okay, thank you. Well, you guys heard it for yourself. Wasn't me who said it. It's just from what I heard. Oh man, the deeper I go up into this uh, neighborhood, the more nervous I'm getting. People are, people are turning away from the camera. They are, uh, yeah. 
not getting the best fight here, that I must say. I never know. The next uh, moped driver could be the one to stop me. Here's old Jesus Christ. I'm not going to make fun of him because I do not want to get killed. Wow. Okay. More people staring. Mamma mia, this place is uh, tense. Wow, bellissimo. The fact is, guys, whenever you go to areas like this, you will always have the normal people that are friendly and welcoming to tourists. And then you'll get the assholes, the gangsters, the no goods, the ones that want to rob tourists and steal from them and that have a problem with you filming. That's everywhere in the world. Check out this little section here. Hello. If I was to get mugged, this would be the perfect place right now. Just need a scooter to roll up here and boom. Whew, nothing. Whoa. Every time they hoot, I get a little mini heart attack. I think they're hooting at me. Well now, the question is, is Naples, is Naples dangerous? Well, first of all, I've only been here for about 15 minutes and I've had one encounter where it was a little sketch. So I can't really answer that question. But as you saw firsthand, people say it is dangerous, especially with the camera. So I would say yes. I would say it's more dangerous than the, the previous cities that I've been to, especially Poland. Um, wow, this is really beautiful. And on every corner there is little shrines with Jesus and Maria. I'm very, uh, I'm very cautious to film them because I don't want to upset any, anyone and make them angry because religion in this part of the world is taken very seriously. Well, that's a dead end, so let's go down this way. Buongiorno. So let's go this way. Wow, guys, every street is like a, another little adventure. It doesn't really feel like I'm in the... Like I'm in Europe right now, it feels like I'm in... Somewhere like Colombia or who knows? Definitely doesn't feel like Europe. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Come si chiama questo quartiere? Quartieri spagnoli? Sì. Si. Spagnoli. Okay, grazie. Well, I don't know what happened to those guys. I'm assuming something bad. Holy moly. This really is like no other place I've seen in Europe before. Mangiare qua? Ristoranti? Si? Okay. Scendere. Okay. Chiedi. 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 Ninnella. Ninnella. Ok. Ristorante Ninnella. Locale. Trattoria. Okay. Trattoria. Oh, perfetto. Fai buono. poco. Ok. Mangiare buono. Buono. Perfetto. Allora. Dritto. Dritto. Scendi. Scendi. Dritto. Dritto. Chiedi. Chiedi. Trattoria okay. Ninnella. Ninnella. Ok, perfetto. E adesso io vado qua. E aspetta, mangiare. Ok, buona giornata. Ciao. Oh, sabato, sabato. Shoes. Shoes. 
open? Yes. Yes? Is it is it possible I, I film? Yes. yes? Is this your shop? Uh, uh, la casa tua? Uh, no, la... la negozio, si, sì, è nostro, la, si. Oh, ok. Facciamo uh, tutto noi. Repatore, eh? Repatore? Uh, Repair? Nigeria, uh, Londra, uh -huh. mercati esteri. Oh, interessante. Ma ah, vai, fai foto, non problema. Ah, oh, cool, cool. E quanti, quanti anni? Qua? Eh, Troppo? 10, 20, 20 30. Wow! Uh, father, ah, mamma e papà. Wow! Come si chiama questo negozio? Eh, Fabric. Fabric? Sì, è una fabbrica. Uh -huh. Il negozio sta un'altra parte. Uh -huh. È solo, solo sabato. Questo si preparano e poi si portano al magazzino. Magazzino? Ah, ok. Capito, capito. Wow. Ok. Grazie mille. Ciao. Buona fortuna. Ciao. Ciao. Grazie. Oh, so they were they were really friendly. There was a shoe repair shop that is um that he that he's taken over from his grandparents and so something with Nigeria, so Nigerian shoes and such. I wasn't I didn't understand too much. And I think it didn't even have a name. That's how, that's how local the place is. So if you want to get your shoes repaired, go there to that guy. He was cool. Hey, kitty, kitty. Hey. Come. Are you a gangster kitty? Are you a Napolitano kitty? Hello. Ooh, you're a cutie, eh? You're a cutie. Hello. Hey. Oh, yo, yo, you want scratch? You want scratch? Hello. It's okay. All right, let's carry on. Well, he was a friendly cat. Surprised he didn't rob me. <laughs> that was a joke, guys. That was a joke. Take it easy. You guys get offended real quick. Especially the people that are from these areas. So when I make a video of an area, it's always those people getting offended. And leftists, of course, and SJWs. But that's nothing new. Those, those people don't bother me. Perfetto. Wow, Hola. perfetto. Cool. One second. I put it here. All right. Napolitano. Si? Okay. Flash in the... Originally South Africa, South Africa, South Africa. South Africa. See, cool. I got myself a little Naples drink, a slush puppy, as we'd call it in English, or at least in South Africa. It's always. Uh, should we go back up here? Yes. It's always. It's always funny when you buy something and you have a camera in your hand. The little awkward moments of exchange, the exchange of money and product is always always pretty entertaining because it's not easy. Filming with one hand, getting the wallet out, and yeah, it's, uh, it's a little complicated. And let's give it a taste. So, maybe like this. Oh man, that's delicious. Tastes like, uh, like nothing I've had before. Some artificial blue flavoring that tastes pretty good. And refreshing in this weather. Very nice. Cost me one euro. Can you believe it? Dove una troppo pericoloso quartieri qua? C'è una pericoloso quartieri? Una zona troppo pericolosa. Sì. Qua? Tutti quanti. Tutti. I think my little tour of Naples' most notorious area, or ghetto, as some of them call it, has slowly come to an end. So far, from the people that I've spoken to, and the little experiences that I've had here, for the time being, has been quite alright. I mean, I've had no serious, dangerous encounters or anything like that. All I've had is some 
Let's just wait for the cars to pass. All I've had is some funny looks and one guy. Wow, oh, so noisy. All I've had is a couple of funny looks and one, one group of people telling me to stop filming. The rest of the people here seem pretty friendly and uh, welcoming to tourists. Well, it looks like I'm approaching the port now. So let's see if we can cross here at the zebra crossing. Uh, ah, good luck. Good luck, Kurt. Let's see if we can stop a car. Let's go. Right here. Um, what was I saying? Ah, take a look in front of me. It looks like I'm approaching the port now. The sea. Let's see if we can see the volcano from here. That'll be cool. Um, who's this guy? Garibaldi. Most of this, most of the statues that you find in Italy, like this, are often of. Garibaldi Nicola Amore Well, it's not Garibaldi That's for sure I don't know who that guy is So over there is the castle over Here they have a little pier In the background is the Vesuvio A little beach Quite the uh, Quite the savage Beach they are taking a Swim at Okay guys so, to answer the question, is Naples dangerous? To put it simply, for me and from my experience, no. Maybe if you're a gangster or if you come across the wrong person at the wrong time, then maybe yes. But so far, for me, it's been a-okay. So for now, I'm going to end this video over here. And you guys will see me next time. Ciao.